Hello guys, welcome back to my reaction channel. Today we're going to react to Bleach Greatness episode 276. Now guys, in the last episode, Baladana actually showed us what he's made of and it seems to be rot. My man looks like the Soul King, but my man just a skeleton with a huge bougie uh, well, coat and uh, a crown, as a matter of fact, and everything he touches rots, and including Soifon's arm. So, my girl armless right now, and I mean, she has one arm left, but bah, her lieutenant had to cut off her arm just for her to survive. And yeah, I don't see them beating this man without a long rage powerful attack that can actually defeat him without them touching him Cause, yeah, my man's OP, so I'm expecting a lot from him and his design is dope as hell But that being said, I ain't gonna pull on this that much If you enjoy my reactions, feel free to share, subscribe, like, leave a comment Ring the bell for notifications guys, follow me on Instagram, join my Discord server And my Patreon page where I'll put it to man, let's jump right into this Reaction, oh, let's go. Bleach 276. Look at that design. There goes the arm. Even the bone. Damn. How amusing. <clears throat> it seems that even soul reapers are afraid of yeah. death. <laughs> My editor made a joke like, gods of death are afraid of death, like Shinigami, like, but we saw that in Death Note too, right? Like, Ryuk and the others literally were afraid to die, even though their universe was a vast no-man's land, like, everything was rotting and it was just boring as hell, but they still remained around because they were afraid to not kill people, do their job, because... That way they would die, right? So that is not that that is actually a familiar concept when it comes to Shinigami. They're afraid of death, which is ironic. <clears throat> this guy's way more terrifying and dangerous than Aizen ever was. Whoa. We can't get near him, let alone touch him. So how the hell are we supposed to defeat a guy when we can't even attack? Long rage! Listen, earlier you were saying that it's your duty to assist me. I uh guess you're right. But I said that because I think both of us will need to combine our efforts to defeat this guy. <laughs> Act as a decoy. Draw him in. So you mean one-on-one? -on -one? I have an idea. Wait, 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 no! It's impossible! I'm counting on you. Wait, uh, Captain! Wait a sec, Captain! Where did she go? Come back! <laughs> Set up. Bro, my man's strong. Love it. He can do a saddle without doing anything. I made my move. It's your turn. You've seen my saddle twice. It's only fair you return the favor and show me a bunkai. Oh. Okay, so Shunsei's strategy is interesting. He's pushing this guy, Espada number one, supposedly the strongest Espada amongst them. To go his full power, is that smart? Because if he's not in Bankai state when this guy releases his Resurrection, he's going to have a chance to cut Shunsu in half because he's not going to be at full power. Like, then again, this guy seems like he doesn't care about the world, so he might not do it. But still, it's a risk. But he keeps suggesting, he keeps pushing for him to go full power. He doesn't want to participate if it's not when he's at his full power. Interesting. <laughs> Oh, oh, Ukidake. All right, attack. Bro, what? <laughs> he took her. Bro. Right here, Come on, put more oomph into it. Bro, my man, my man straight out bullying this little girl. Bro, my man bullying her. I mean, I guess he's so OP, he doesn't want to kill her. So this is actually merciful, but still. That's hilarious. My man bullying her, took her sword and everything. <laughs> like treating her like a bull, bro. It's... What's wrong? We're not you worried here. about that kid down there? Give me back my sword! No, it's not One that. That kid down there is your subordinate. She's a fraction, right? Can't say I grasp what their relationship is with an Espada. It's just something I realized. Once you felt that kid was in danger, I saw that you couldn't keep your mind focused. <laughs> Oh, oh, damn! Oh. Not bad. Hmm. Are you 
incapable of mounting an attack alone. I know one thing. I better keep my distance from this guy, or he'll turn me to dust. That's facts. Shut up, stupid skullhead. I'll show you a thing okay. or two. Except I've got nothing to show him. My man old talk. From your actions, it appears you wish for your son Puck Toe to rot away he as well. He can do that. Oh, you're gonna be defenseless. Oh, you're done. I'm not self-destructive. I'm warming up. My attack was stronger than I thought. That's all. So I was hit by some rubble. Wait, that's it. Let's see you keep up with me. If okay. Okay. So he's gonna use rubble to attack him because he doesn't care about the rubble, and he's gonna smash buildings and then use the remains to throw at him because he can't throw his weapon. But yeah, this guy is definitely OP. But like I said. He rendered Soifon's uh, Bankai, like, useless because she has to touch him twice to kill him, but she can't even touch him once because she's going to run away, right? Very interesting, but it looks like she has a plan, so I'm curious. I am very curious. You Let's can! Go. How boring. All you're doing is running away. Yep. What I have to do is lure him to some place where it'll be harder for him to fight. Fighting him up in the sky where he has a clear view is pointless. Damn. Good thinking. You realized you can't attack with your Zanpak toe, so you tried using other objects. You're right, I don't expect some small glass shards to hurt you, but what about an entire building? That's not gonna work, he's gonna go through it! Okay. Did it work? It's gonna break out. Did you just say bought you more time? You say some interesting things. Where is he? Have you forgotten that I signify the aspect of death known as senescence? Time means nothing before my power. It's time for you to suffer the dying breath. Respira. By now you must know, you cannot take this sword back from me. I'm afraid that's reality, and you need to accept that fact. I don't know anything about loyalty and stuff like that, but Coyote and I... Coyote. We're different than the other Respadas and Fraxiones. We just are... So he's Coyote Stark? But my suspicions were correct. You became a little desperate after thinking I was going to go after that kid, didn't you? And so what if it is? Do you think that lecturing me is going to help you? Possibly. I'm not sure that was my intention, but I'm thinking that's definitely the key to the two of you. Huh. Haven't you realized you can't evade my Respira? I released it slowly on purpose. I know your captain is hiding out there somewhere, and I will find a way to flush her out. I can't do anything directly using my Gigetsu booty. It'll turn to dust. That's just my luck. Why isn't my Zanpakuto a Kido type that shoots flames or ice or does something really yeah. great? Took him that long to figure out he needs a. Oh, damn it! I almost blinded myself with that. You know, when I really think of it, I can barely use keto. Idiot. So, oh, she's there. Screaming out loud like a coward, idiot. Can't leave him in charge for even a second. What? Is... When this fight is over, I'm gonna beat that loser within an inch of his life. What is she doing? Yo, that's a dope weapon. Whoa! What the hell is that? Gran Kaida. A guillotine too good for a coward. Uh. Is this Soifon? Jaku Horai Koben! Oh, Hornet Thunder God Whip, bro. Did I never. I never saw her Bankai before, right? That stinger was Shikai State. Just the first time I've seen her Bankai State? Oh, hell yeah! So that's what your Bankai looks like. If possible, I had hoped to end this without using this Bankai. This Bankai 
It violates my standards as a member of the Stealth Force. <gasps> what? It's too flashy for an assassin. Oh, it's long range. <laughs> it's a bazooka. Okay, I think you just stopped the attack. Well, that's a nuclear warhead. Well, what the hell? To be continued. I oh, shut the hell up. Yes. That's when it was getting crazy. Okay, so if one. Bro, this whole time I thought that Chica State was actually Banka. I don't know why, but. Okay, so this was the first time I ever saw her Bankai. That That is uh, an interesting design. Interesting attack, long range, okay? It was like a nuclear warhead. And I think uh, Valagan, like, hit it with a, a death ray or something before it hit him. I think he's gonna survive, but definitely interesting. And she was hiding. Like, why was she hiding this entire episode to just release her Bankai? Like, was she gathering strength? She kind of tied up that building with... I don't know, but I think she set up some traps. But I guess we're gonna find out in the next episode, which I might jump straight into. I might not. I'm considering it. But let me just watch this end credit scene, and then we'll continue. Pity guide to Soul Reapers! I wonder if Captain Ukitake is alright. Hey, don't you think we should be fighting for Captain Ukitake? Yeah, you're right! I'll get ready! Oh, Captain... Wow, these guys are ridiculous. Oh. Hey, I'm ready. The camera's ready. Yeah, they're they're ridiculous. They're ridiculous, but yeah. Regardless, uh, interesting episode. Balagan's definitely strong as hell, but uh, hmm, I don't know, bro. I, I don't know how strong Soifon's Bankai is. This guy is definitely strong, like, and he should be able to run away every attack that comes at him, even long range. Now that I think about it, so maybe a uh, like Sado could defeat him. I don't know, man. I don't know how how because everything that comes close to him, he just rots it away. So, hmm, right? Interesting. This guy's strong, but I'm guessing considering that Soyphone and this guy are on him, are they gonna defeat him? I don't think they're enough, but maybe I don't know, bro. I, I, I'm still stuck on how Holly Bell and, and the way she lost like she didn't have a scratch on her and then she just lost Bruh, like they we need more of her bruh, and Balagan and Stark We do like they're supposed to be top espada and so far Ulkiona's battle with Ichigo was 10 times better than all of these battles combined Right, so we need more that being said. I ain't gonna prolong this that much. I enjoyed this episode Hope you enjoyed the reaction and I'll see you in the next one. Stay safe, love you, enjoy, and bye.